<laughs> Teacher. Hello, Heidi. Good evening. Believe it or not, I'm still working. I believe it. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> no problem. No problem. I understand. It's kind of complex, right? Yeah. And we were but, happy that today was Friday. Yeah, we were happy, but you know something? It is a, a great start for my branch. Oh, really? Yeah, because I am achieving my my mortgage school. Early in the month. In, in day number one. I'm sorry? In day number one. That's cool. It's super cool. Yeah, because I mean, uh, of course, you're going to be looking for making more, but uh, you're going to be working a little bit with less stress. Exactly. Because last month was kind of difficult. Yeah, I was supposed to 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 sign this one yesterday, but we couldn't make it. But so you did we it did today. it today. And mm -hmm. that's good because you are. I mean, uh, are you any close to your goal? I already achieved it with with this with this. This one, today. did you achieve it? That, oh, yeah, I passed it twice. Oh my gosh, it's congratulations! Yeah. Those are great news, it's deal, but yeah, it's great news. But you know, uh, we got 14 goals. 14, this is only one. <laughs> well, I'm one less to worry right. about, one less to worry about, and one big, big one, the, yeah. big. the biggest one. Well, yeah, I mean, that's great. I mean, let's hope the it's a it's a good omen. Yeah, I know. It's a I good know. omen for for your branch. Yes, and and it happens that I have to be here because it's it's me the one who signed in the name of the bank. Okay. I have yeah. special permission. Oh, so you are the representative. Exactly. Oh, and I have oh. to sign my mortgages and another branch's mortgages. Oh, really? Yeah. That's why yeah, it's, so, it is so heavy here. Yeah, I understand you. So you are quite busy. I'm sorry, teacher. I have to leave no, you. Well, don't worry. Don't worry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Hey, Eliana, how are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. <clears throat> Good evening. How are you, lady in red? Fine. Thank you for asking. Hey, you got a dimple. Yeah. <laughs> so, how's everything? How was your day? Well, today was a very slow day. Well, it's, it's tell me why. In the first day of the new month, So, um, most of the time, the first day of the next month is kind of slow. <clears throat> oh, really? Yeah, and the paperwork was less than yesterday. And, well, at the office, <clears throat> they, I don't know if that the correct word, they brought, use Giovanni. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they broke, they broke. Uh, a kind of um, small group of music. Oh, really? They was yeah, they was playing uh, they tropical. Playing. They were playing, thank you, uh, tropical music. Because it's the summer and vacation, and it was it was pretty pretty fun actually. Oh, you had fun. Yeah. But uh, after that, at the, at the afternoon, very, very slow. Uh, that's kind of yeah. boring, right? Yeah. But yeah, that was all. No. And no much to Friday. tell. And what's the plan for tomorrow? 
Well, <clears throat> I have to go to to the doctor. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm not sick. It's just a, uh, a regular appointment. Yeah. Okay. Uh, to, to check some something that that I will always check uh, once a, a year. Okay. Um, and let me see what else. Maybe at lunch. Maybe maybe my 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 mom comes there to us with my my to eat with my siblings and and, and me. Okay. And I don't know. Maybe stay at home. I feel a little bit sick, but I oh, think yeah. it's more than a, an alert. I think it's allergic. Oh really? Yeah, but <clears throat> I hope That's that it. I, I yeah <laughs> that that just it. And no, not much to tell the chair. It was a very very slow day for me today. Yeah, it looks like that. a little bit. Yeah. Down. <laughs> yeah, getting coming down with the flu or uh, with an, uh, an allergy is not good. No. Yeah, it I... makes you feel pretty uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. And if the weather is hot, it's terrible. Yeah. And if you've yeah. been in the in air conditioning and then you go to the to the hot weather, it's worse. Yeah. That's yeah, that's my everyday. I'm in a in air conditioner all day, but at lunch, too hot to go out. outside. Yeah. 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 And when you come out like that, you feel the, the, the heat from the from the street. It's terrible. Yeah. So sometimes I prefer to stay in my office and I, I take my lunch there. Yeah, that's better. Yeah. And that's what about better. you? Me, well, let's see. Oh, kind of interesting. We were pretty busy all day long. Then came home, then just went to. Oh, believe it or not, I I had dinner already. Weird. Yeah. Yeah, that's so weird for me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, ooh, my car is giving me trouble. Uh. And I was. Actually, a few minutes ago, I was just checking it out with a friend, and tomorrow we're gonna check out some other stuff. Actually, on Monday, on Monday it's going to the mechanic because I had already set an appointment with the mechanic because I mean the regular checkout, and I need to fix like shock absorbers and some stuff. But I mean uh, something else is giving me trouble, and you know. Fixing cars is money. money, money and more money. It's no good. I don't like that. No. So that means that tomorrow I will have to go to work, but on the motorcycle. Or, yeah, better in the motorcycle because taking out the other car, man, I need to move one car, to move one motorcycle. To move oh. the other motorcycle and then <laughs> taking out the other car. Man, it's tedious. Yeah, may, maybe it's better take the option number one. Yeah. More easy. Yeah, it's easier. It's easier. Yeah, I mean, I'm just going to take out the motorcycle and that's it. No problem. Mm, okay. So that's that's for me, actually. That's everything. Let's see. What else? What do I have tomorrow? I got class. I got a meeting. I have to receive a class. I got a meeting with the. Oh, I got two meetings in the morning. I got one meeting with the, with the mayor. From a little town where I'm working, mm. and then I have <clears throat> meetings with some people. Then I got class in the afternoon. To receive class. Then I got another meeting. And then at night, well, we're going to mess up with the car again. <laughs> Sunday, let's see. Oh, Sunday is not going to be good. I have to go shopping. <laughs> I remember you told us that you don't like 
No, no, actually, I mean, for me, it's okay for shopping, but man, we are looking for two things. One of them is shoes. Mm. What kind? Not for me. <laughs> so it's going to be a long afternoon. Yeah. Your weekend is going to be busy. Yeah. Well, mostly my weekends are like that because I mean, usually before uh, or when I'm in the week that I'm not teaching, some of those errands we do them during the week. I mean, after work, we go to the gym, we go buying shopping something. That's cool. But when I'm working on the weekdays at night, that's the problem because I mean, we come from work. Uh, I come from work around 4 30. Uh, I just come, shower, relax a little bit, go to the gym and come back here sometimes while i am in the gym i'm listening to my class the one that i'm receiving at the university then we come here uh, shower again then my class then dinner then sleeping so mm -hmm. i mean my day is like that all the time yeah so i don't have time like uh, they need something and they gotta wait for me it's complex and my son doesn't drive at night i mean he thinks he's not ready yet. He doesn't feel like, he doesn't trust himself. <clears throat> he's not that confident. Well, so I'm um, the designated driver, but you know, that's life. <laughs> so I'm waiting for vacation time. At least one day I'm going to oversleep. Yeah. And our sleep for me is like waking up around 7 30 8 a.m. But that's about too late. Yes, it is. No, the problem is this I'm too used to it. And besides, if I, if, I mean, if I wake up and try to go back to sleep, it's not possible for me. Oh, well. I am actually, I am pretty hard to wake up, but no. Uh, you gotta throw me out of the bed so I can wake up. <laughs> but once I, I'm up, I mean, I don't like sleeping during the day. No. Oh, okay. Or naps. I hate it. You don't take naps? No. I get drowsy, you know, uh, uncomfortable, heavy. Really? Yeah. I'm weird. I'm weird. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because you don't like pupusas, you don't like semita, yeah, and yeah, yeah. you don't take naps. <laughs> yeah, I'm not that normal, they say. But it's okay. okay. Eliana, a pleasure talking to you. Mm -hmm. well. Thank you, teacher. <clears throat> Jose Wilfredo, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How's it going? So far, so far so good. It was a relaxing day because I have one short day today. So I, yeah, I go left uh, at 4 p.m. because I work um, 7 to, to 5. So today was 7 to 4. Okay. That's yeah, nice. it was really cool. I uh, just was busy at morning because uh, in the morning I have to enjoy, I have to join it in a lot of conference room uh, to check uh, some metrics and something like that with the main client and he asked us some tricky question, but we can solve it. Okay, well, that's cool. What's a really good day. day? And then uh, on, in the afternoon, oh, it all was calm down. Okay. So, yeah, was really relaxing. That's nice. I mean, it's, it's good that you, yeah. that you have a slow day, that you can relax right before the weekend. That's awesome. Yeah. And it's. Mm, more perfectly yeah. that I will rest on weekend. That's nice. Yeah, it's really yeah, nice because I could enjoy a lot of. But 
uh, have one this manage that I will spend more. Oh yeah. <laughs> usually that usually yeah. happens. Yeah, that's right. My wife uh, tell, telling me that, okay, now we can go to the beach on Saturday and way back to the Sunday and we can do something with the family. Yeah, that's, that's cool. Yeah, but as you said, it's, it's mine. Yeah. You gotta spend. I mean, yeah. But you know what? Uh, something that I have come to realize is that you gotta look at, at at that time, like spending on your, on yourself, because I mean, you're spending yeah. on, on you being calm, being relaxed, having fun. And I mean, actually in the end, that's what we work for, no? Yeah. And because we cannot be just focused on, on well, some people are on getting yeah. more and more money. And, and I mean, that's okay for them. But for me, in my case, in my case, you know, money for me is for spending. Yeah, we can, but I guess that we have more uh, advantage than the Spanish. Yeah. 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 And, and I mean, you have fun, you share with your family. That's what matters. Yeah. As I told you before, I uh, most of the time I plan what's going on with my financial and something like that. Yeah, yeah, and that's important uh, to, to think yeah. ahead. That's always important to think ahead. But I mean, also it's important to, to have fun, you know? Oh, um, yeah. You need, you need to have fun. Because otherwise, what are we working for? <laughs> yeah. Hey, mister, welcome to the class. Well, it was a pleasure. Always is. Thank you. Let me get the attendance. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Amber Eli Alfaro Gomez. Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Present teacher. Henry Meftalí Mendez Torres. Eliana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Present. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. Present. No. Present teacher. Thank you, Jacqueline. Uh, Jose Marcos Rodríguez Ayala. Present. Jose Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. Jose Wilfredo Ayala Sorca. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Rebeca Jasmine Monterrosa Figueroa. Present. Roxana Ibeda Asensio de Mejía. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Thank you. Billman Frank Figueroa Peñate. Present. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Ada, hello Ada. How are you? How's everything? Um, I keep the day, teacher. I did Quiet. not have a A uh, calm day or a slow day? A slow surgery day. today? A slow day. So no surgeries today? No teacher, no surgeries today. Is the, of the fluoroscope equipment is free in the security social. Um, and my day is a uh, review and discuss the surgical care case for the next week. Um, okay. In the afternoon, I went to the clinic 
there were uh, the no patient today. I okay. I dedicate myself uh, to answer the answer in sending the email. Um, go to the my house is around seven p.m. I the target of the my sanitation protocol and prepare the dinner and have dinner with my family. It's a yeah relaxed day. Okay, well that's good. I mean, yes. Once in a while to have a, a slow day is good. Yes, teacher. Hey, I um, the next week uh, accumulate accumulate yes. the accumulate. work for accumulate the work for the depend the prepare the equipment. Okay. Yes. And the in the in the in the world the private hospital depend the emergency. <laughs> it's necessary the yes. I prepare the the platform and prepare the class. Prepare. Yes. Prepare the yes. It's a okay, well, relaxation. Yes. Okay, excellent. Thank you and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay, guys. Well, 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 well. Before I move on, uh, I need to talk to you guys. And the reason of why I need to talk to you is the following. Um, today is the last day of for section two, which means that supposedly today we are supposed to have finished section one, section two, and Milton. And according to my According to the platform, uh, I was checking the platform a few minutes ago. I just have six of you who have finished the section one and two. And I just have five of you who had already finished a meal term. And that's good today. So uh, please, I will ask you to to work on it if possible tonight after the class. And let me know because I'm gonna be like uh, updating the the, the sheet. Uh, well, I'll, I have to be up until midnight in order to do it. So you're gonna help me a lot if you do it before, but I'm gonna be waiting until midnight in order to do it because tomorrow morning, my problem is this, I gotta be teaching uh, in the morning and it's face to face and I go out pretty early so that means that I cannot check it until noon but the people in the office they check it out tomorrow at nine it's when they start checking out everything and when they start calling me and asking me what about it so please if you can work on it today do it if there's any situation that you are going to work tomorrow on it, let me know on a little message so I can tell them, look, uh, yes, this person is going to be working and I'm going to be updating this day and I'm going to be having it ready for Monday or something like that. But I need to, to, to tell them something. So please let me know and work on it. Let's continue. Let's see who else is around. Oh, just give me a second. Okay, sorry guys, just to fix something. Well, let's see, let's see, Ana Claudia, hello, good evening, how are you? Hello teacher, how are you? I'm doing, I'm doing very well, just here fighting in my room <laughs> with a smell, you know, I don't know why. Fighting in, in your room with a smell. Yeah, with, with a, I don't know how to say, 
Yeah, with a smell. Ah, okay. I don't know why uh, there are, I don't have cats, but my neighbors, they have thousands of cats, but they come exactly in my roof. They made the, they made peace. <laughs> They feed. I know. I don't know if it's because we don't like each other. It likes God, cats, they don't like, I don't like to them and I don't like them. <laughs> I don't like them and they don't like me. Okay. I don't like them and they don't like me. I love dogs, but cats, mm, I don't know. I don't know why. They are not my oh. friends. But they come all the oh, they make peace on my roof. So they pee I on must, my roof. I'm suffering here. <laughs> Ana Claudia, they pee on my roof. They pee on my roof. Okay. It's not peace, it's pee. They pee, yeah. Okay. They no, pee on my is roof. The, is the liquid, but, but the action is that they pee. Ah, okay. Good to know. Thank you. So they pee on my roof. And it's so such strong smell. My God. Yes. And I have my fan on. Also, I was spraying some uh, stuff right here. Oh my God. But they always do it over my hair. <laughs> yeah, it's I mean it's a strong smell and it's hard exactly. to get rid of it. Exactly. I don't know why they like to pee in the, in los, yo no sé cómo es, en los canales, en los canales, because I saw no. them. Yo no sé cómo decir esa parte de la casa. You're talking about the, you're talking about the gutter. What is the name of that? The, let me fix it for you. Gutter, no, gutter, gutter. You're talking about the roof gutter. Roof gutter, okay. I don't know why they love to make it in there. I saw them. <laughs> no, 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 yeah, I believe you, I believe you. I mean, every once in a while we get like a plague of cats here in my neighborhood and mm -hmm. man, it's a big mess and mm -hmm. I have to go up the roof and clean sometimes. Yeah, I understand. My God. Some people says that if you, um, pour? No, water them? No, si nos moja, si, si echa agua. Okay, if you throw, if you throw water on them. Throw so. water, uh-huh. Some people say they don't come back, but I don't think so. Me neither. <laughs> these cats, I mean, and even though I like cats. I don't know. I haven't had a cat never in my life. Maybe I don't know them at all. That is why I had the opinion that I don't like them. I have them. Had two cats. Mm. And they, they were nice. Actually, my cat and my dog used to sleep together. It was fun for them. Uh, so you have right now a cat and a dog? No, I used to have a cat. Ah, okay. So right now you don't have neither a cat or dog? I just have one little dog. Ah, okay. Okay. Yeah, but it's a tiny thing. That thing is not a dog. It's something. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, is the thing is this that I like big dogs, but you know, if you got a big dog, you gotta have a space. Yeah. Well. And but... and I don't think the space I got is enough for a big dog. Ah, okay. Because okay. I mean, otherwise they get stressed. Yes, they get stressed. We use music for our dog. I have it in Martian, and uh, they are so <laughs> hyper, but. It's the second one we have, so we are like get used to what a Dalmatian needs. Mm -hmm. uh, my dog is crazy, you know. Uh, it's funny. My dog is pretty jealous. Mm. I cannot hug nobody. Oh, really? Like nobody yet. <gasps> he starts jumping and barking <laughs> and running whenever he sees me close to someone, like hugging him. I get to my son and I start like hugging my son. 
he gets barking and, and jumping that he wants me. Is a he or a she? she? It's a he. Oh, maybe he thinks it's a human. Is your sound too? <laughs> yeah, but uh, I mean, he wants me to pet him, and I mean, it's ah. like uh, I'm not. I don't. The dog doesn't usually get into my bedroom, but if I am laying down in the bed and he gets into the bedroom, he starts jumping for me to pet him. Mm. Even there, and if I don't do it, he tries to bite my toe. To what? Bite. Ah. Uh -huh. Little bites. Uh -huh. To 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 get my attention, and that's funny, you know, because that he learned from my cat. Oh. The cat really? I used to have. The cat used to do that. He used to bite my toe so I could pick him up and put it on my lap. <laughs> oh, what a funny thing. Here in my home, uh, what I guess my dog, she thinks she is a human and she thinks she's the second daughter of my sister because also my sister, I, I think she, she falls because uh, from the very beginning, I told her, don't bring her to your bed. Don't let the, the dog sleep with you. But she didn't want to, to pay attention to that. And so I think the dog feels and thinks she's another human. <laughs> yeah, they do. They do. I mean, uh, well, with dogs, it's, it's like they, you are part of their family. With mm -hmm. cats is different. They are very demanding. Oh, really? Cats wow. are very demanding. I mean, they want uh, they want attention when they want it. Mm. If they are not in the mood, don't get close to them. Mm. Wow. They are pretty independent. Yeah, they're cool. I like them both. I like them both and cats, but I like cats. Yeah. Ah, okay. Good to know. Yeah, the only problem I had with my previous cat was that. He was very good for hunting. Oh, so he brought you like gift? Yeah, like birds. No, why bring him? He used nice. to eat them. Oh, he ate them. Yeah, he ate mice, he ate uh, birds. Mm -hmm. His food and the dog's food. Wow, I don't know why they live dogs food too my other mm -hmm. sister has that problem the cat something is that dog... drives them nuts is the smell of chicken oh really yeah oh. they love chicken oh maybe for that reason they like dogs food yeah mm, that must be it hey Anna Claudia nice talking to you Welcome. thank you teacher the same to you Let's see. Well, guys, uh, before we continue tonight, as I told you, uh, in the manual, we just have a little exercise, pretty small, it's like five minutes. The rest of the class is going to be speaking. But for next week, I'm letting you know, we are going to be dividing the class half and half. Half speaking, half the manual, because we need, uh, the next two weeks, we need to cover a lot of material from the manual. We got a sec for next week is one section just in one week. So we'll be working a lot. But let's continue. I still got people here. Let's see who, 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 who is around. Hey, Stephanie, how's your throat? Hello, teacher. Hello. Oh, there's a Stephanie. Back. Yes. Yeah, but yesterday, it, I don't know who was it. Was sense. your brother? <laughs> Yes, it's the middle of the Stephanie. Ah. <laughs> yeah, you are half and a half. Yeah, because yeah. yesterday you were pretty deep. Yeah, yeah but you know that happens. That happens uh, during <clears throat> puberty. Yes, it's because in worry. my work I have I have to talk. So, uh, oh. so I I don't know. I I spend my voice. I don't know if I can say that. Yeah, yeah. I thought it was puberty. I what? I thought it was puberty. So? Pensé que era la pubertad. But no. <laughs> it's something completely no. different. Uh, it's yeah. uncomfortable to be like that, actually. Yeah, I hate that. But hopefully, I think um, for um, 
maybe Monday I will be I will be better and I will have my 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 real voice <laughs> back back yeah. yeah that's cool yeah of course I mean the weekend the resting on the weekend is going to be helpful for you yeah but um, you know, I think tea, today was good yes I I, tea, I drink tea relax a lot of liquids yes my mom always tequila. gave me that no <laughs> no teacher that no <laughs> That's no, that's good. Food. You know, with five it's lemons, right. or was it five tequilas, <clears throat> one lemon? You can try them. I mean, one of them is going to work for you. <laughs> okay, I will say the teacher said that is a good idea. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you know, that's, yes. that's a good prescription. <laughs> As a doctor. <laughs> yeah. Remember, but... in this case, we are saying prescription because when we say... Uh, Receipt is for food. Prescription is okay. for doctors. Okay. 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 So the one, the one a doctor gives you is a prescription. Sorry, uh, okay, prescription. Okay, the I didn't know that. Receipts are the special ones that your mama passed to you. Like this is the way you prepare chicken. Uh, <laughs> yes, but uh -huh. I, I well. think I'm, I'm good. Better than yesterday, and better, and I will get better for the next days. <clears throat> Let's hope so. Let's hope so. I mean, yeah, because I mean, in we in our case that we work speaking a lot. I mean, our voice is very important. Yes, it's true. Really, 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 very important. Yeah, I mean, eh, I don't know how I would do if I lost my voice. Just once in my life, I was losing it a little bit, but I usually have problems with my throat. I mean, I get infections and stuff. I mean, that's normal, the weather and stuff. I'm speaking all day long, but I don't usually lose my voice. I mean, it doesn't even change. It's just the pain, the oh, killing yes. pain. I feel like, um, I don't know how can I say, uh, como picor en la garganta. Itch. Like inch in my in my in my throat. No. I, itch. That is what I itch. Itch. Yeah. Itch. Inch means pulgada. Itch. Oh. Okay, I feel itch in my throat. So for that I I I I still drinking. I don't know, but I feel better when I drink water. So when I feel that I just um have I cough and then I take the the, the water. Yeah. Well, you know, the worst thing for me is that I cannot drink, I cannot take the the, 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 the medicine for, for the troll, like the, what do you call that? Amoxicillin. No, 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 I can take that, but just, I gotta be careful with some little thing. No, the, oh man, this thing. Nevocaina, graniodin. No, no, the, the syrup, uh, the cough syrup. Uh, this thing, the cough syrup. Venado light, teacher. Yeah, that one. No, nah, that's vodka. <laughs> uh, you know, the problem is this. The okay, for teacher, Bruce. For me, it could be either, uh, gin, rum, or scotch. Just like that. And any of those three are cool. If you are well, talking to me about gin, man, I love it. Rum, it's okay. Scotch, it's nice. <laughs> little bit, little bit. Not too much. Not too much. What? Just, Teacher. just to clear your throat. Yeah, I mean, with half a bottle, it's, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That is his listerine. <laughs> that is his listerine. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you keep on taking it until you feel nothing. Maybe you confuse the name. It's Listerine, the one that you need to use for your throat. Okay, what? <laughs> well, okay. now they have one. Now they got one that ain't got no alcohol, so. <laughs> that one's no good. I don't like that one. I like the one with alcohol. I like it to burn. Mm. Mouthwash, mouthwash. 
Ana Claudia. Okay, mouthwash. Okay. Yeah, mouthwash. Okay, well, uh, thank you, Stephanie. Let's see, let's see, let's thank see. You, hey, oh, I need to ask this. Frank, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi. I need to welcome you to the weather in San Salvador. Don't tell me you are still yeah. in What? I'm back. To, I'm back to reality. Okay, yeah. welcome back. How's the weather, <laughs> my friend? Uh, so, so different, sir. <laughs> so hot. Yeah. Welcome back to our life. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. It's totally different. And it's it must, very hot. It must feel... I mean, in your case, that we are coming from many days staying on a cold weather. I mean, the, the impact of, of the heat must be strong, right? Yeah, yeah, it's very strong. It feels very, I don't know, very strong, the impact of the change of weather, right? The weather yeah. change. Yeah, it is. Like, uh, I, I'm just arriving. It's uncomfortable, actually. Yeah. You feel like some stress, and I don't know how to say it, but this, I don't know how to say, como hostigado, fatigado. Oh, I know how to say that. Uh, you knew, you feel drowsiness. Yeah, Although drowsiness. I... Yeah, that. Yeah. What about we disgusting? I'm sorry? What about we disgusting? Disgusting, no. But in this case, it's drowsiness because you feel like, uh, you know, modorra. Yeah, like feel modorra. Low, low energy, right? Yeah, I mean, you feel like a little bit low, down. I mean, a yeah. little bit blue. I will, I will take your, your advice to Stephanie. Oh yeah, sure. That. Yes. The you know, they say, <laughs> you, they say they say drink with measurement. So you get a big cup to measure how much you're gonna put. Yeah, on. yeah, yeah. Of course, yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Of actually, you know, I don't know. Uh, people usually take uh, uh, hard drinks when they yes. get like when it's hot, but those things actually they don't help. They dehydrate you faster. Yes. And drink no. coffee, you say? When it's no, hot? we are talking about we are talking about hard drinks. Ah, okay. No, I don't know them. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know them? No, teacher. What about wine? Do you think wine is a hard drink? Yes, oh. it is. That thing. Oh. Well, it depends which one you take, my dear. Oh, I think the lowest uh, grades of alcohol. Yeah, oh, because it's... I mean, like 15 grades, it's, it's a little but something. It just, but when I drink it, I'm eating at the same time. So that helps a lot for the impact. Mm -hmm. my yeah, okay, sure. Yeah, of course. And <laughs> I drink that just, for example, on Christmas. But you know uh, what the hell must? Hmm? What is it? You know what the, what the hell must when you drink? Keep drinking. It's, be, it's before that you drink now. It's before you drink uh, like one, uh, one um, how do you say liter? Liter. Liter. Liter, right? Okay, one liter of water. That helps a lot because yeah. uh, you have a hangover when you are uh, uninhibited. Oh, uh, really? Yeah, oh. but if I drink a, li a liter of water, I'm not drinking no more, man. I'm like full. <laughs> oh, but like, that's not nothing a after one liter of water. I'm going to be like up here of liquids. That's an advice for a... Uh, uh, expert. I should, um, yeah, yeah, expert told me. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's that's what I can <laughs> tell. That's what I can tell. I still... Oh, I heard that. I heard that. Okay. I yeah. heard that. Yeah. No, yeah, no, yeah. no. You know what you gotta say? A friend of mine said, Yeah, a, fr a friend told me that. Yeah, a friend told me that. Yeah, hey, reported speech, you see? Yeah. Nah, but man, it's the weather is terrible. So welcome to the weather, Frank. Thank you, teacher. 
<laughs> yeah, you gotta suffer as we do. Hey, let's see, let's see. I still got, yeah, I still got five minutes. Who else is around? Oh, I know somebody. We were talking about drinks. Hey, drinker. Maria Alejandra, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. Hello. Now, oh, as we are talking about the heavy drinkers, uh, that's why I'm talking to you, Maria Alejandra. <laughs> Sorry, Maria Alejandra teacher. goes like soda, just soda. <laughs> no, <laughs> I drink it, but I. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I tea. I, I like to drink tea. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Manhattan tea. <laughs> no, teacher. I like to drink a uh, apple or a smith or a, a sprit. Uh -huh. hmm. That's uh, nice. Gin tonic, but I don't. Oh. But no. <laughs> gin, gin tonic is good. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. So you must like a, you must like a Tom Collins. Huh? Have you ever tried a Tom Collins? No. It's a cocktail. I recommend it to you. You have the chance to try it. A Tom Collins is a cocktail. Actually, you take it before before having lunch. It's nice, or lunch or dinner is nice. It's an uh, appetizer, an aperitivo. It's pretty good, uh, and it's a smooth. It's not like a, it's a mix of a certain uh, alcohol. It got the mood. It got gin tonic, uh, but it's soft and it's nice. It doesn't hit you bad. I mean, you don't feel like like inebriated, but <laughs> okay, I try to do the taste uh, yeah. No. Try it? Uh -huh, I try it. Uh -huh. I try it to uh, order when I see in a menu. Yeah, no, it's good. It's good. Actually, I like it. I mean, I take it once in a while, but it's good. <laughs> okay, but I don't like the beer picture. You don't like beers. Oh, no. I'm so sorry for you, but we still like you, you know. No worries. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, what's your plan for the weekend, Maria Alejandra? Let me see. Mm -hmm. Going to your mom, going to visit your dad, stay to at Granny's. What else? Um, no, uh, I only see my, my dad on Thursday. In the morning, and I don't know. I don't have a plan. Maybe tomorrow I have a long day, and then uh, I don't have any plans. Maybe I only stay in the house and see a series or like this because um. For I talk uh, the move to for the house or apartment today I see at uh, the other house and maybe have a plan to if you uh, I don't know to cruzando los dedos finger crossing uh, finger cross to to happen that to move at the house I see I saw today and. I don't know, maybe I don't have a lot of money I can spend. <laughs> I prefer to stay in my house. And oh, no. I feel that the gas is, is expensive and my tank and, and this or less to very fast. <laughs> mm, ah, well, and, you know that the problem must be the person who's driving. <laughs> that no, affects a teacher, lot. maybe I think that <laughs> I do a lot of errands and I prepare to for the next week for a wedding at uh, the oh the wedding maybe I talk, uh -huh, the wedding yeah, and, the wedding you got the dress uh, in the end yes I got the dress and what I color think is it? Is maybe navy blue? 
Uh huh. Uh huh. But I'm a, uh, very I'm a man. I'm a man. So you gotta tell me. <laughs> it's blue. Uh, it's it red. Is. Is blue, don't tell but, me. Uh, don't tell me navy blue. I mean, that thing for me is blue. Simple. It's a blue, but dark. Okay, that's something that I can uh -huh. understand. Okay, that works for me. But if you come and tell me navy blue, now actually, yeah, you know, it's funny. I can, I can make the difference between plenty of colors because, uh, 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 as I told you once, uh, my my mama used to to to, to she was a dressmaker, so uh, uh, I I used to work with her. I used to learn, and I used to help her. But in my case, I used to help with little things because uh, mostly I was sewing just by hand, little details because we used to make uh, dresses for parties, for weddings. Ah, uh, okay. It's so very I, and we used to make dresses for the maids of honor, men, some ugly things that I have seen. <laughs> it's very complicated when you decide for a different dress or depends. In my case, it's the first time to uh, make me to be a bridesmaid. How do you say that? Bridesmaid. Bridesmaid. Right, and I think that thinking for uh, what the what uh, dress to choose or like this, and I don't like the option to the rent a uh, dress. Maybe uh, I don't do any more in the future. <laughs> yeah, you know, but hmm. There are options, actually. There are options, but renting is expensive, uncomfortable, and uh -huh. takes time because they gotta they gotta make it fit to your body, and it's a dress that is not made for you. I mean, uh, when it comes uh -huh. to dresses, it's complex because I mean, when they make it for you, just when they make it for you, you gotta go like for three or four fittings, yes. and you gotta keep your weight something complex when we get stressed <laughs> yeah because i mean on regular clothing that's not a problem i mean uh, on regular clothing you you gain a, some pounds i mean you just you just get, wear looser clothes but when it comes to to a uh, dressing to a dress the dress gown yeah uh, it's complex i mean you notice those little pounds Actually, and the same happens to us guys when it comes to suits. Because, I mean, uh, uh, yeah. you can have a well-cut suit, but if you gain on weight, it looks horrible. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> that a penguin. Or and, uh -huh. and, you know, and sometimes you can, uh, you can damage, you can injure people with your bottoms when they go flying, you know. <laughs> and when you prepare for to eat the dinner. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, but that's, that's easy for us guys, because when it's dinner time, we just get the, 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 the belt a little bit loose. <laughs> okay. Uh, the thing and the difference when you uh, when I use a dress is I choose a a don no sé, pegado un vestido pegado tight uh -huh, uh -huh. I don't choose a tight a, a tight dress because I don't have a lot of options and I think in that my I feel comfortable all the night and I stay very early in the church and I think at that church. the hot no, no, in this case is in, no I'm sorry in this case is in the church because uh, it's a specific one uh, in the church because uh, I think that the weather very hot and I don't know I may be um, I feel, I feel um, preocupada, uh, worried, worried uh, for the shoes because I have a lot of time to don't use a heels 
Um, <laughs> I don't know. I have a different type of pain. Well, don't but... worry, don't worry, don't worry. I mean, <laughs> there's many of us in the same situation, you know. I don't remember <laughs> last time I wore some high heels, so don't worry. You're not there. <laughs> Yes, but it's complex. Maybe I hope to in a in a, a short time any with my my friends to have married or like this. <laughs> the best advice I could give them is run as fast as you can. Run. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Miss. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Uh, um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Fernando, I got a question for you, Fernando. Well, we were talking, we've been talking about, hello, good evening. We've been talking about drinks, we've been talking about weather, and we were talking about a little bit about eating. And now that's what I want to ask you. Do you remember yesterday I told you we were going to be talking, continue talking about food, but mostly about eating. And so tell me, Fernando, are you a fussy eater? Fussy eater? Yeah. Uh, what's mean fussy, teacher? Okay, when you say uh, demanding? Demanding, okay. Yeah, quisquilloso. Oh. Are you uh, a fussy eater? A fussy eater. Mm, yeah, maybe. Yeah, like, oh. A, like uh, oh, if it's not as warm as you like it, you don't need it. If it's not as cold as you like it, you don't need it. If oh, no. a little bit salty, you don't need it. Are you a fussy eater? Not the chair. I'm, I'm not a fussy eater. <laughs> only which, uh, my only problem with, with the food is vegetable. I don't need all vegetable. Uh, only, only a few vegetables. And oh, really? Raw, Which one do you eat? Uh, only potatoes and whiskey. Nothing. <laughs> whiskey. Mm, I know the word. Okay. Potato and well, whiskey and onion. Um, carrot and just that. <laughs> oh, really? Just those ones? Yeah. Yes. Yes, the other vegetable I perhaps I, I, I eat, but uh, but only for, you know, I pay for that. <laughs> but I prefer I prefer other other meats or meat or or chicken i love chicken and oh, really? i love rice and i love rice mm. yeah you know i like uh what you call it the uh, chayote uh, i like it yeah i love rice but uh without vegetable only rice with uh consomme i, lo I love white rice you know I love it. For me, having white rice, ooh, I enjoy it. Yeah, it's good. But yeah. uh, how, how do I say consomme? Hmm. Squeezes? El sazonador, no sé. Yeah, yeah, that must be the word. Uh, uh, sazonador, that's seasoning. Seasoning, okay. Yeah. I love a lot of fries with seasonings only, only just that. So um, sometimes I cook rice, only rice, and and I eat <laughs> watching watching a movie only rice. Oh really? For yes. watching a movie? Mm, that's yes. interesting. Yes, only that's only only a pot with with rice with seasonings. Seasoning. Yeah, seasoning, seasoning, seasoning with seasoning. Yeah, only well, that flavor. That flavor is my favorite. That's a first for me. That's a first for me. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well, yeah. That's interesting. I never heard that one. Well, you know, uh, 
I I have her weirdest thing. Don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> so you are not that fussy. Thank you, Fernanda. Nice talking to you. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, let's see. Francisco, hello, Francisco. No, okay. Rebecca. Hello, Rebecca. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Hello, I'm here. Oh, there's Francisco. <laughs> I was a, a little busy, teacher, but I, in, this, in this moment, I am ready. So, you working? Uh, no, teacher, in my home. Oh, but, okay. Uh, <laughs> in okay, the, okay. No, no, no home, I understand. The, 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 the work, the working is similar. <laughs> yeah. yeah, being there, don't that got the teacher to prove it. Don't worry. <laughs> so tell me, what about you? Are you a fussy eater? Mm, no, really, teacher. Really, no. Uh, not really. I, I not really. I consider I, I have a much a patient person. Oh and, really? Uh, yes. Uh, in in the uh, oh area, <laughs> because uh, for me it's not problem a uh, wait for a uh, uh, a lunch. Uh, okay. In the in in the um, how do you say reasonable tissue? Reasonable. Reasonable. Okay, uh, in the reasonable time. Okay. For example, uh, when a restaurant is full. Uh, you understand that it's going to be, yeah. Yes. You understand that it's going to take time. Yes, teacher. Oh, yeah. Well, that's cool. That's cool. What about, what about the food is cold? Do you eat it? Uh, Teacher, could you re repeat me the question, please? What about if the food is cold? Do you eat it? Cold? Um, yes, fría. Fría. Yeah. Um, in my case, teacher, uh, uh, I always, uh, I like me uh, eat uh, food uh, warm or Oh really? Well, it's, yes, it's, yeah, yeah. Uh, I I uh, I like it. the world uh, oh. food, the okay. cool food. Mm, Not acceptable uh, for you. No, <laughs> not this. Okay, no, it's okay. It's okay. I mean, how, teacher, everybody's how do different. Say, how do you say incluso? Yes. Even, even, even uh, when I. Uh, by uh, bread, I like me a, a. You warm it up. Yes, this. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. I mean, that's the way you like it. You are a little bit fussy, my friend. <laughs> I, I I don't know, uh, but I I but I like me the 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 word food. Uh, okay, no, it's okay. But I I, uh, I think that the, the flavor is better when the when the food is is warm. Okay, well yeah, of course. <laughs> Thank you, Francisco. Okay. Okay, let's see, let's see. Uh, Heidi, hello Heidi. Still busy? I think so. Man, she's been working hard. She was at the office a few minutes ago. Well, Ileana, what about you? Are you a fussy eater? Mm, it depends. Sometimes. Sometimes. Mm, maybe fussy with the price. Because, okay. yeah, uh, sometimes I like to try new platillos or um, dishes new dishes and for me uh, for example 
if the price is high or, or a reasonable price, not 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 a price like like the um, regular, not regular, regular, like a regular dish. For me, is is the the price is high. It must it must, it must taste, be worth it. Yeah, it must taste good. For example, I, uh, a few days ago we were talking about seafood. Well, I I told you that I am uh, I only eat shrimps because yeah. once I try pulpo. Oh, octopus! Really octopus? delicious. Yeah. What? Delicious. Yeah. But uh, in in that occasion, uh, it was um, I don't know how to say it. It wasn't good. It, oh, really? It was como como chicloso, no sé cómo decirlo. That's part of the taste. No, 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 but no estaba bien cocido. Yeah. You yeah. like it. You like it well cooked. No, I like it raw. Oh. No, in That's my case, I like it well cooked. Yeah. And so it was like, no, 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 no. So in that in that case, I am a pussy eater. Okay. Yeah, because I mean, you are a little bit picky. Yeah, but just sometimes because, <laughs> you know, I mean, you, to you can you can munch down a hamburger and you're cool. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, cool. That's fine. That's fine. Excellent. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome. Okay, guys. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh. Let me get the second attendance because uh, then we're gonna do um, we're gonna keep work working, but with some other questions. Ada Susana Casares Mendoza. Present teacher. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Uh, Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Jairi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Henry Neftalí Méndez Torres. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Ileana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Present. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. Uh, thank you, Francisco. Jose Marcos Rodriguez Ayala. Present. Jose Osmin Rivas Navas. Present. Jose Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Nicolás Satirio Méndez Granados. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Wilmer Frank Figueroa Peñate. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Present teacher, sorry. Thank you, Ramon. Thank you, friend. Teacher, you forgot me. Really? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Rebecca Monterrosa, say present. <laughs> present. <laughs> no problem, no problem. Thank you for reminding me. Okay, yeah, the problem is that I'm watching, uh, I'm looking at two screens at the same time, and sometimes that distracts me a little bit. Just that in one I got the list and the other one I got you, so I check out that you are really here. Okay, but let's continue. Okay, now I'm I almost sure that the, the answer for this question is going to be in the affirmative, but I want to know what's the reason why the answer is like that. Do you care where the food you eat comes from? Or the, do you care where it comes from? 
That's interesting. I mean, like if you are going to cook at home, uh, like meat, some people prefer to go buy meat at the supermarket. Some people prefer to go buy meat at the market, right? Or some people prefer to buy cheese or cream packed, you know, from, from a brand. And some people like the one that they sell like free. What about you guys? You're gonna have just three minutes. It's a very short question, okay? You're gonna have three minutes. Please jump into the groups, talk about it, and then we come back. Groups are created, please. No, no, no. Success is, success is, is exit, right? <laughs> yeah. Teacher, ¿cómo se dice suceso? I'm sorry? I, I, I was talking to Frank and, uh, and Stephanie that in my case, uh, before uh, the pandemic, my family and I, sometimes, for example, with meat, uh, we used to buy meat at the market, but after the pandemic, that, that, ese suceso is okay. Oh, that event, event? Ah, okay, thank you, that event. Uh, I'm sorry, event, event. Event, okay. That event uh, makes that, that we uh, decide to, to start to, to buy the meat only at the supermarket. So for me, the pandemic, was a very important event in in the in in this case. Uh, if we are um, talking about uh, comida vegetables, cruda, vegetables, row row. How do you how do you write it, please? R A W R A O oh. row row. 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 Okay. Row. Yeah. It's like, you know, like, uh, like when it's a barbecue, I like my meat, but when I bite it, it goes moo. Yeah. <laughs> For me, it must be like, like bloody. bloody. A little bit. A little bit bloody. A little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Yeah, yeah well. Like well done is like, not for me. I no, mean, I, if you got my meat well done, I mean, that's for choose, perhaps, but not yeah, for but eating. A good piece of meat, it doesn't worth it if you cook, you, if you overcook or something, right? Yeah, yeah. you're totally how, how well. do, Yeah, tell me. How do you say, uh, corte de carne? 
a cut, yeah. Cut. A cut of meat, yeah. Specific cut of meat, yeah. Yeah, the other day my, my son and his friends were, they were cooking meat. I don't remember the name of this cut. Mm. But it's, it's a good cut, but I don't remember the name of it. And, but, well, anyway, the thing is this, that it was a good cut, but his friends, they lay, they lay it like almost black, and I was like, what? Nah. You don't do that to me. I mean, no. <laughs> You know, yeah. English is funny because, I mean, the, the animal is a cow, right? A cow, a bull, or not. But when it's their meat, is beef. Beef, right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It's beef. It's like the pig. You know, pork is not the live animal. Pork yeah, is yeah. the meat. It's, it's the meat. So yeah, beef that's... is like fresh. Yeah. But it's, if it's veil, because, I mean, you can go buy a race, right? A big animal yes, yes. alive. Yes, yes, yes. But in their case, beef is specifically the cut of yes. meat. Yes, cut of meat. Exactly, okay. their meat. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's like, we love a beef steak. I love it, with a lot of onions. Yeah, of course. The, the, the famous here, bistec. I love bistec. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's beef steak. Yeah, I love yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, guys, let me go check the rest of the books. Okay. okay. It's it's since uh it's no it had a good appearance, <laughs> but I don't. Uh, I am not a fusilier. <laughs> I am not a fusilier, but I I suppose that I need to clean clean food and you know in the place. The place too is important because I like to I like to eat in a in a in a clean place and with Let's see, everybody's coming in a few seconds. Mr. Rivas, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you, Jose? Um, great, I'm great. Okay, tell me, do you care where the food you eat comes from? Where does it come from? Uh, yeah, so nowadays, yes. Why? Uh, so, because we have to make sure so, so if the food has been prepared correctly for the virus that we are having now, right? So that is kind of complicated to check. So if so, you can eat or not, right? Okay, perfect. Yeah, yeah. And well, you can get many illnesses, right? Yeah, yeah. So now I remember, I remember at... Uh, uh, Around three years ago, no, basically two years ago, I ate uh, meat. So like was not in a good uh, status or have been prepared Ooh. good. So and then so next day, so I couldn't go to my my job. So for working. Uh, uh, I understand, I understand. That has happened yeah. to all of us at least once on our life. That's so I was, a, yeah, I was about to, uh, I mean, go in. No, it's like, subirme is, subirme bus taking 
Yeah, to board to board a bus. To a board to a take bus. a bus or to take a bus. Mm -hmm. to, mm -hmm. to take a bus. So and then so I decide to test to my supervisor. So I'm not able to to go work. to work. Mm -hmm. To go to work. Uh, don't worry, don't worry. That's, I mean, at least it didn't happen to you what happened to me once. I, I went and spent five days at the hospital. Sorry. And so basically, so it's good, right? Because you can, you are in a sick leave, but with the, with the bills. I, mean, with I, the spent, bills. I spent five days at the hospital. That was terrible. And the only good thing was that one of the medicines they were putting on me got me asleep all the time. All the time. <laughs> and man, I slept as you wouldn't imagine. It was that was the only funny part because the rest was terrible. Thank you, Jose. Yeah, you're welcome. Marcos, what about you? Do you care where the food you eat comes from? Yeah, teacher, I care because um, for example, I don't like to buy if I am in the street, I like to buy sliced fruit. I prefer to buy uh, to buy the entire fruit and then cut it by 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 my own. And if we are talking about restaurants, I like to to see the to see if in the restaurant follow um, instruction or um, the process of of cooking is. Thank you for my help because I think uh, in every place we can get uh, we can get a disease. We can yeah we can get we can get a disease or or stomach pain is very dangerous for us. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay, guys. Now I got a good one, a very, very good one for you. Uh, you got a problem, you know? You have to convince me, recommend to me one national dish, okay? And I, I'm telling you, it's a problem you got. So the, the question is what national dishes from your country would you recommend? At least two, I need you to recommend me the dish but be prepared to explain to me how do you prepare that dish, okay? At least the ingredients, because I mean, I'm not gonna eat something that I don't understand what it is made of. So at least or you tell me some of the ingredients, so a little, some of the steps of the process to prepare it and why is it good? Why do you recommend it to me, okay? So guys, um, the groups are open, but let me first get you the, the question. Okay, then you got the question. And at least two, okay? You will have 10 minutes to prepare that. I need a good presentation and choose one from your group to present it to me. Jump in. Oh, this we are going to choose. Uh -huh. Hey guys, what are you going to recommend to me? Oh. In my case, teacher, <laughs> Choco. 
It's on my watch. No, that's a yucky teacher. I never try it. What? Pito and I watch them. Oh, no, that's terrible. Oh, <laughs> oh I never try it. Chuk that's for Chuko teacher. I watch, I watch the actually, I only pass it on Chuko. That's the only situation when I can do it. But with a mango too? Nope, I don't need mango. Ah. What happened to you, teacher? Don't you like mango? No, really. Uh, if I eat it this once a year. Oh, okay. Come on, teacher. Teacher, what do you eat? <laughs> Some other stuff, but no mango. I mean coffee uh, all the time. <laughs> you know, if I if I drink mango refreshment, I feel like throwing up after that. Oh okay. Is the bad for me, so now nah, I don't eat mango. I don't like mangoes. What other fruit do you eat? <laughs> Let's see, I eat bananas, I eat uh, peaches, grapes once in a while. Oh, the big, the big red apples are the only ones that I like. I don't like the small ones. Uh, <laughs> oh, come on. And I don't like green apples either. Okay, green up on grapes. Just the red ones, not the green ones. Okay. A little bit complex, um, right? Watermelon? Yeah, no. I I like it, but it's not good for my stomach. Ah, okay. I love <laughs> hey, something. I love something. Teacher, you came with a lot of manufacturing defects, teacher. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, man. I'm sure about it. I I still got that complaint to my mama. <laughs> you you, you no. are a, a pussy eater, right? A little bit, and I don't like salty food either. Okay. This is my but, favorite fruit, look, sapodilla. 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 Oh, okay. yeah. But it, it it's rare to, to find. Sorry? Or not to, uh, is it escaso? Sapodilla? Nah. No. 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 Okay, but no. In, in my, in my series is hard to, to find. Really? Yeah. Man, where I work, you get, get many, many, many. You end up a little bit sticky, but I can eat like three or four now. I mean, and I'm happy. Okay. I love it. My family have a three. In all really? the time to have, uh -huh. yeah. And Maria Alejandra likes, she even likes when they got little worms, you know, she takes the worms out and keeps them. In the series, in the series, it's hard to find it, but really, yeah. No, you uh, know, actually, here in San Salvador, you find it, but okay, returning to the, to the topic. Choco, teacher. Yeah, it's cool. I like it. Okay, but you I don't. Uh -huh. Okay. What are you gonna kill me with? Pusas. With pupusas. No, please, no, no. The chicharrón. Oh, the loroco con queso. No, the papelillo. Oh, de cochinito, oh. de cochinita, de mora con queso, Leo. ¿De qué va a querer? La loca, mejor. Ah, no, sí. none of them. I don't like the. I mean, the only ones I can pass are the the mixed ones, the ones that got pork, cheese, and a little bit of beans. That's the only ones I can pass. But if they are rice. Mm. Rice. No, are, come on. Yeah. What about the ones of corn? The corn, corn pupusas. No. Corn. Oh, no. Pass. I was thinking inviting you to eat pupusas here in my con in my country. <laughs> my dear, in the other group, group, they wanted me to eat mango, and I don't eat mango. No, come on. That is, I cannot live with that mango. I love this season because of mango panades. Believe me. My dad had a tree. Big things like this. Exactly. Wow, they are so delicious. Never, never in my life. Did Dice, I can I ask five. you, what do you eat? Do you eat just water or coffee? I mean, no, no. I mean, I was telling them, 
One of my favorite fruits is zapodilla. I like it's what? It. Zapodilla. Zapodilla. Yeah, zapote. Ah. Oh, no, but I'll be on back, the regular guys. I'll day? be back. That a group is calling me. I'll be back. Okay. okay. My friend, they left you alone. What yes, happened? Teacher. Yes, oh, okay. Don't worry, don't worry. I'll send you to another group right away. Okay, teacher. La plancha de un solo. Uh -huh, but that, I, I don't know. That teacher, teacher, we are <laughs> no, we are discussing how to name where you uh, prepare pupusa. And we found this word, griddle. But also yeah, we griddle. found iron and also iron. pen. What is will be the, the most, the better word Oof. to use? Oof. What a problem, what a problem. Why, because griddle? Yeah, griddle, griddle. Griddle, griddle. Yeah. Riddle. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but what you're talking here is something different. And uh, let me text it for you. Because I know mm -hmm. this word. Well, actually, it's two words. What you're talking about is a cooking plate. Cooking plate. Uh huh. Mm. Uh -huh. That's a cooking plate. Así se llaman las parrillas pequeñas, perdón, que me pasé el español. Plancha, you say. Sí, pero. Sí, también, parrilla, la plancha para pupusas, así le podemos decir. Yeah. Y la parrilla pequeñita, una pe no tan pequeña. That's a griddle. Ah, ok, ok. Cooking plate, it will be the one for pupusa. Yeah. Ok, tell us what do you prefer. We're thinking in explaining you how to prepare your lovely pupusa. You know, I, I was this close of, of really, really liking you. I'm kidding. Teacher, <laughs> can I ask you, what do you, do you regularly eat on a daily basis? I mean, you don't eat a lot of fruits, you don't eat a lot of vegetables, you don't like a traditional you know, food. It's now coffee. that you mention it, it's, it's funny. In my house, they buy fruits and stuff. But the problem is this. When I was growing up, I never, we were not in the habit or like opening the fridge uh, and checking out and getting something. I mean, uh, I grew up in a very traditional environment and mm -hmm. strict environment. So you used to eat breakfast, lunch, uh, a little and snack dinner. and dinner. Mm -hmm. But for lunch, I mean, if there was a fruit they used to put you the fruit you were going to eat. I mean, you were not picking the one that you wanted to eat. Mm -hmm. It was there next to your plate and you knew that it was your dessert. Okay. So mm -hmm. I'm not in the habit in my house. I go to a supermarket. I buy a lot of stuff. And sometimes, believe me, I, it's been like one week for me without opening the fridge. Mm -hmm. I mean, I just open it sometimes to get ice for uh, uh, ice water, and and that's it. Mm. And when I want a snack like a midnight or something, I get a tablespoon of peanut butter, and I'm like, licking it. Mm. Okay. And that's it. I mean, but I'm not in the habit like we. Sometimes I bring bananas, I bring oranges, I rarely, pretty rarely eat an orange, and mm -hmm. tangerines. I always bring, but I eat once on a blue moon. And I mean, there's yogurts, but if they don't bring it out to me, I don't need it. Oh, okay. And and it's funny because I mean, you know, if they if they serve me a big big dish of food mm -hmm. i eat it all and i'm cool if they serve me just a little portion i eat it and i'm cool because so I got today to you will just just what they put so today you just need to sit and you will eat what all the groups we are going to serve you okay <laughs> mm -hmm. 
<laughs> most probably when I go out and believe me, I have to because sometimes when I go out, they invite me for stuff that I, I don't really like. like. Like uh, I remember last September, I went and to visit some friends and they had prepared beef soup. Mm, come on, don't you eat beef soup? Never. No. <laughs> the only the only way I can eat beef soup is is if I am invited in a house that I mean I'm not like pretty pretty close to the people to tell them look I don't need that or in front of my dad. In front of my dad I eat whatever they give me. Mm, okay. <laughs> but the rest of the time uh, uh, no. Beef soup is like chicken soup. What? Gallina you don't India. like chicken soup? I hate gallina India. My hate God, it. what do you eat? Just water, coffee, tea? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Mm. No, but I mean, what? I think, you know, the other day I bought, uh, actually they sold me. Yo creo que usted solo work, en a de comprar y eso toma. <laughs> where I work is so easy to get gallina India. <laughs> so the other day I brought them like, I'm here to, to, to my family. I brought them two big ones for this. And they prepare a big soup and, and they have lunch and everything. And they went and bought in the supermarket in the supermarket chicken breast for me. But no, that thing, uh -uh, I don't eat it. No way, yeah. never. Well, but not to, tonight you will you will eat what we are going to serve in your plat, <laughs> in your plate. Plate. Uh -huh, plate. Let me check the other groups. Okay. Uh, I mean, okay, we have to guys. prepare. What, what you gonna What you gonna kill me with? <laughs> it's, uh, <laughs> delicious food. You never taste something like that. Tell me what is it? <laughs> Fried juca. Yeah. Right, yuca with four rings. With four rings, yeah. I pass it, I pass it, I don't like it, but I pass it with uh, just with uh, just like that and deep fry it. and yeah. not, a, not a lot, a little bit. Just yes, a mm. yeah, okay, so. yeah, but with pork, uh, I like pork, no. I do like pork. And but with salty fishes. Just, I don't know how to say it. Pescadita. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> salty fishes. Uh, you know, the thing is that I don't like salty food. Okay. I'm complex. Yeah. I'm pretty complex. I'm not yeah, easy. Yeah, yeah. I see. I see. I see. <laughs> Tell me, Jacqueline. Is um, the exact word. Is salty fish? Yeah, because I don't know the exact name of that, that little fish. Okay, no, just uh, ask you because I heard that you say, uh, someone say, salt, salty fishes. No. And fish is for plural and singular. Yeah. Okay. It's correct. Yes and no. Yes and no. <gasps> wow. Uh, could okay. you tell me why teacher? Just let me let me get the ideas correctly in my head. Okay, I will explain it to you in Spanish. It's mm -hmm. easier. Sí, normalmente el plural de fish es fish. fish. Pero existen mm -hmm. unas ocasiones especiales en las que usted puede decir fishes. Fishes. Mm -hmm. sí. Solamente es un caso en especial y el caso particular es cuando Hablando específicamente en el ámbito de la biología, usted se está refiriendo a un grupo de peces en el cual van varias especies de peces. Ah. En ese contexto es el único en el cual usted puede decir fishes. Fishes. Yeah. Oh. Ok. Ah, interesante. Good to know. Thanks to let me know, teacher. No problem, but most of the time, yeah, fish, fish. Fish and fish. Ah, okay. Yeah. Usually they teach you that, right? The plural mm -hmm. fish is fish. 
Yeah, but it's there's fish. one case when you use fishes, and it's the one that I just mentioned it to you. Okay. okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, guys, two minutes, two minutes, two minutes. You are ready. You are ready. <laughs> yeah, we're going to ask Heidi to cook. Yeah. Hello, teacher. You enjoy cooking, right? I'm arriving home. <laughs> okay, that's, oh, yeah, I just heard. Heidi, you slammed the door. You know, I can't connect the camera. I don't Already? know why. Yeah, that's this weird. said uh, the host has disabled it. Oh, let me see. What about now? There you are. There you go. I'm sorry. Perhaps I did it by mistake. <laughs> I apologize. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Here I am. Cool. Man, you are late tonight. Yeah. But finally, you are home. Okay. Finally. Your, class, your classmate said that you are the one cooking tonight. <laughs> oh, my God. Really? And yeah. I was like, yeah, what? I don't know. What are you going to prepare, guys? What are you going to tell me how to? What's the dish you are going to recommend to me? <laughs> you will know. You will know later. Okay. It's going to be a surprise. <laughs> That's cool. I love surprises. <laughs> Tomato, tomato sauce. Oh, tomato sauce. So tomato sauce and curtido. No sé cómo se dice curtido. Oh, that's always a problem. Hmm? That's always a problem because I mean, please, please don't look it up in the in the translator. Don't do that. No, no, no. Be because if we are you asking do, to what you, you're, what you're no, but I'm just letting you know, because if you do it, if any time you do it, what you're going to get is tanning. And that's what you do to, 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 to leather in order to work it. Uh, tanning es lo que se le hace al cuero para trabajarlo. Entonces, lo curte. Ah, encurtido, cuando lo curten. Ah, no es curtido, es encur encurtido. Ah, okay. Es que encurtido es el que tendríamos que buscar nosotros, creo. Pico. Yes. Yeah, but what you do, I mean, there's another problem here. Uh -huh. Pickle is the action of encurtir mm. algo. Okay? okay. So, pickle what? Eh, ¿Cómo se dice repollo? <laughs> oh, come on. I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> All of the color, like, guys. Like this commercial of opening to this red chicken. <laughs> 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 You are kidding me here. You just got two minutes, guys. Hurry up. Cabbage, cabbage, cabbage. Only serve the with the sauce, nada más. <laughs> no, Do you want to hear something funny? Uh -huh. I, I can I can eat pupusas and usually with pickled cabbage. It's okay for me. But sauce, if you give me sauce, it's not poured into nothing. You give it to me on a little something so I can drink it. No. <laughs> yeah, that's the only way I can have it. Que no se moje la pupusa. I hate that. I hate that. I know. Icha, you're a very fussy eater. Fussy eater. A fussy eater. That is the word. <laughs> I know. Pickles, cabbage. So let's continue. Pickles, cabbage, 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 pickles. No, pickle, mm, cabbage. Pickle, right? cabbage. Pickle, cabbage. Okay. Okay. I know. Ya me dio risa. Curtido. You really enjoy my. I don't know if you enjoy my class or me. It's, it's, I, I can imagine, teacher, your daily basis without eating. A lot of things that is in our no, I, eat a, I, eat a, I eat a lot of stuff. Yes, the, the, the picture I make of you is like maybe you eat just sustain or I don't know. No, no, I eat a lot of stuff. I, mean, I, eat, I eat plenty that... of stuff. Really? Well, yeah. <laughs> you don't eat beans, right? Pictures. What? You don't eat beans. 
Yeah, once in a while. Ah, okay. Yeah, I mean, I got, I got my problems with beans at school. Do you I eat like eggs? Beans. Yeah, sure, I love. Ah, okay, maybe that is. Uh, you eat a lot of eggs. Okay. I mean, yeah. You can give me a scrambled eggs morning, noon, night, mm -hmm. and I'm cool. Mm, okay. Avocado? Do you eat avocado? Oh, yeah, it's a fruit. Ah. I like it as a fruit. Oh, okay. Not okay. salt on it, just the, the avocado, just like that. Ah, okay. I like That's and cool. I love guacamole. Guacamole? Mm. Yeah, but I love it. Mm. The guacamole is salty. I like it with the lots of onion. Ah, okay, okay, got it. And remember something, I pour almost on everything, I pour hot sauce. Oh, really? Yeah, we got like four Tabasco. different types. Yes, we got four different types here at home. <laughs> we even got the, the sometimes we got the habaneros, like, like the, mm, the little one. Yeah, my boss loves them. I'm going to invite you to the pupusa with trompa de chuchu. <laughs> that thing is horrible. Yeah. That thing is horrible. Really? I love, I, I like, I like hot sauce. I I'm love hot you, sauce. I don't like a hot sauce. I mean, the spicy. I, sauce. Well, yeah, but, but that one you just mentioned, it's horrible. He really? Used. I haven't yes. tasted because I don't like the spicy or. or don't do it. Don't do it. If yeah. you are not no, used to it, don't do it. If this. you are not used to it, don't do it. Yes. Because I have eaten it. I have eaten it, and I mean, it was hot. It's strong, pretty hot. Mm. I could stand it, but I didn't like the taste. Uh, mm -hmm. And I mean, it's oily and weird. I mean, that thing looks oh, sick. Okay. Ah, got it. No, I don't eat it. Chile, como se solo chile? Yeah, uh, uh, hot peppers. Hot peppers, okay. No, I'm not. I don't eat any type of. Oh, hot yeah, peppers. I love jalapenos. Oh, mm -hmm. Good for you. I don't like them. Yeah, I just had, today, today <laughs> I had a hamburger with a big jalapeno like this. Okay. Real mm. jalapeno. Delicious. It's like I don't understand people that to all food they use lemon. That's. The, the food will be tasting to lemon food, not the uh, real food. Yeah, I don't know. Usually, lemon just with certain things. Okay, well. Let's go, let's go, let's go. It's time. Okay. Sure. Yes, Fernando? I have problem with, with the midterm. Okay, stay at the end of the class and I'll help you, okay? Okay. Let's see. Nom, 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 nom. I got one, two, three groups. Let's see. I got uh, hmm. Ada, Susana, Ana Claudia, Francisco, Ileana, Jose Rivas. From that group, who's going to present to me? Oh. Ileana. No, okay, Ileana. she volunteers, yes. <laughs> okay, you volunteer. Yeah. She you. was the one for the idea. <laughs> <laughs> you you <Okay>. traitors. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Ileana, your turn. They choose you. I mean, democracy goes like that. And this democracy, is democracy. Democracy, you said Ana Claudia. We didn't vote, we didn't yeah. vote but we, we feel like she's the one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. Okay. Well, you are present. the victim. Yeah. Present. What you gonna present to me? Let's see if you combine me. Mm, well, we are. Oh going no! I don't to... like it. <laughs> Come on. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, we are going to prepare for you pupusas. Okay. okay. There are many. Flavors, uh, flavors. Mm -hmm. it's, it's right, of pupusas, yeah. but this time- Varieties, of... varieties, in this case is varieties. Varieties, okay, varieties of pupusas. But tonight, for you, mm -hmm. <laughs> we mm -hmm. are going to prepare pupusas revueltas. Okay, mixed. Mixed pupusas, mixed pupusas, okay. Yeah. 
So for this national dish, we need dog, masa, dog, dog. Yeah, but corn or rice? Rice, dog. Okay, cool, cool. So uh, to prepare the, the dog, we are going to use hot water with the okay. rice dog. So we are going to mix that the pot, the dog wow. with the water. Uh, after that, we are going to prepare the mix. Okay. Uh, with cheese, refry it, refry beans. Okay. And I don't know in if in that in this case we we say pork or chicharrón. Pork, pork. Pork? Yeah, or pork. pork. Well, so uh, we have the, the dog ready and the mix ready. So you take a, a bowl, a, a little uh, of dog yeah, and make a, a bowl. A portion of dog and make a bowl. Then you have to put a, a little portion of the mix into the, the, the bowl. And you start to, to I don't know how to say it, to... Palm it? Oh no, rub it. Uh, rub it, yeah. So uh, after you have the, this bowl, you, you start to palm, palm it? Yeah. Until it's flat. Okay. Uh, meanwhile, do that. Uh, we prepared a, a cooking plate. Mm -hmm. So when the cooking plate is, is ready, we put the the flat dog yes. over the over the cooking plate, and uh, meanwhile, if the pupusas is cooking, we prepare the sauce. We are going to to use tomatoes, uh, okay. onion uh, to prepare the sauce. You mix uh, onions blend. and tomatoes. Mix or blend. Blend. Okay, because they put it into the blender, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, right. You're right. Uh, you blend the ingredients and ingredients. Ingredient, ingredients. Thank you. You put the ingredients into an oven. Yeah. And no, not oven. Oh, como una, porque no es, no es sartén, es una olla. Pot. 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 Thank you. A pot and then you have to, okay, team, help me, please. <laughs> to, to blend the, the, the ingredients. Uh, no, you have to, to, I don't know how to say it, como darle vuelta, to. Turn it over. Turn it over, the, 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 the pupusa. Uh, oh, flip, flip over. Flip, flip over the pupusa. Please. And when the pupusa is ready and the sauce is ready, wow. we serve in a, in a, in a. Plate? In a plate with and, that's and that's it. And we invite you to taste the, the cabbage, the pickled cabbage. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, right. I forgot that. Mm -hmm. Awesome, Liliana. Yeah, <laughs> great, great. Great. You explained it very all, well. All, <laughs> I, I almost believe it that she can do it because she started that like. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. I show we know. Great, great. Let's see. No, it was cool. It was cool. Let's see. Next group is Heidi, Jacqueline, Ramon, Stephanie, Frank. Who's going to present? I. Okay. Yo. Okay. Well, we got us a chat here. Do it. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, first of all, you never taste something like that. <laughs> well, uh, what's the dish? <laughs> We will explain you the recipe of fried yuca. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, uh, wait, wait. So, first of well, all, that's easy. yeah, I mean, first of all, you have to peel the yuca, then you have to cut into small pieces while the oil heats up. Then you have to submerge it for a few minutes until it is ready. Immerse. Immerse. 
for a few minutes until it is ready. Finally, you can serve it with uh, some cabbage. Pickled cabbage. Pickled cabbage, some tomato, some cucumbers. And at the end, but not the last, you cannot miss the pork ring. Okay, cool. And if you Simple. prefer, you can yeah. serve it with a salty fish. Okay. Right? So, Very simple. Yeah. Easy. But delicious. <laughs> okay, perfect. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Let's Thank see. You. Let's see. Now, next to the group, I got Fernando, Wilfredo, Marcos, and Maria Alejandra. Who's going to present? If you want, I will. Okay. Well, so Wilfredo, tell me what, what is it that you're going to, 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 to recommend? Okay. I will recommend Chuko Hato. Oh, love it. And the ingredients. Which are... one? Which one? Which one? Which one? Which one? In El Salvador, we got us three different ones. Uh, I don't know, teacher. Just one. I, I know just one. Okay, because there's a salty one, there's a yeah, sweet salty, one, salty, salty, salty. and there's a sour one. No, it's a salty. Okay, yeah, because the sweet one, I don't like it. The salty and the sour one, I pass it. What is the dish? I'm sorry. You got salty? You no, no, no. The dish that the chuku she atole. Gives. Ah, okay, chuku okay. Atole. Excellent. Do you know what okay, Please go ahead. Chuku atole? Yeah, it's one that is not clean. <laughs> okay, so you have to prepare two pounds of purple or black corn. Okay. And then uh, uh, you have to grill the corn food and put them uh, in a pot with water. Then you have to move it. Stir it. And after that, yeah, still it? Stir. Still. No. Uh, stir. Okay. Stir. Then you have to stir with the water until get a consistent jelly. And then you only have to prepare the white thing. You better buy it in the market. It's easier. Yeah, you, you also could add a uh, spicy. Oh, and hot sauce. Then, oh, hot sauce. And, and the beans. And salt. Yep. If you if you want, you can add uh, well cooked beans. Okay, and yeah. That's it. Then you it's are ready to eat. Okay, perfect. Thank you. I actually like it. Chocolate is nice. It's nice. It brings back memory. Thank you, guys. Very good. You were working. Actually, you know, the the the, the activity was not the the biggest part of the activity, and what I was most interested in was not the presentation. Whereas what I was is in the fact that we were working in groups and speaking and helping each other to understand and to look for new vocabulary because you were uncovering new vocabulary. Now let's see. Where's Heidi? Heidi, where are you? I'm right here, teacher. Oh, yeah, yeah, right there, right there. Heidi, tell me, food, we are talking about food. Tell me a guilty pleasure you got. Something? I like this, um, this uh, I, I don't know how, this chocolate cake. That's a guilty pleasure for you? Yeah, but there's one yeah. in a special. Tiramisu. I remember it's called toxic. Oh really? Yeah. Toxic? Yeah, it has a lot of, of, of kind of chocolates. Oh nice. You're talking about the cake of Chesandre? Exactly. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's me. I love it. Ah, mm -hmm. Okay, okay, perfect. Thank you. 
Now, let's see, what about you, Marcos? Do you have any guilty pressure when it comes to food? Mm, I don't know. Perhaps. When we say a guilty pleasure is something that you know is not good for you, but you love it. And once in a while, you eat it. Okay. Mm, sometimes I like to mix uh, fruit with, um, I don't know how is the name of English, sauce, words, or something like that. I don't remember. Okay. But uh, uh, we have fruit, we have, for example, guava and apple, and pour down a lot of, of English sauce. Yeah, I think okay. I, I know it's, it's not that good for my health. <laughs> but okay, like but it. you got it and you enjoy it. Perfect. Yeah. What about you, Jacqueline? Do you have any good to pleasure? Uh, yes, teacher. I love work in all the recipes that you can cook. Cook it. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I love pork rings with some lemon and some tortillas. Okay. And also the spice. That's cool. I it's mean, if you like it, but remember, don't overindulge. Yes, yes, I know, teacher. Yes, I try to eat uh, maybe once a week or twice a month. Okay, that's cool. Ileana, what about you? you? Tell me a guilty pleasure you got. My guilty pleasure, I think, is the spicy food. Okay. It's not good for my colon. For nobody, actually. Yeah, but I love spicy food. Uh, with tacos, with soups, with meat, with chicken. Sounds everything. I, I, yeah, I put some some spice, spice hot sauce. Yes. Yeah. And me when too. the, yeah. But the spicy food, yeah, it's not good for me, but I love it. Understand you totally. Let's see, let's see who else. Uh, Mr. Rivas, what about you? Jose Rivas? Yes, I'm here. Tell me, tell me, what about you? Do you have any guilty pleasure when it comes to food? Not, not really. Not really? No. You, oh, okay. Probably well, beers. Probably beers. Probably, probably beers. Probably beers. Ah. Well, yeah, yeah, the same as I told. You don't have to overindulge. Or, mm -hmm. That's no problem. A couple of a couple of cold ones, it's okay. A couple of boxes is not that okay. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Okay, thank you, Mister. And Stephanie, what about you, Stephanie? You've been too quiet tonight. Mm -hmm. Almost, almost all junk food, you know, as hamburguesas, pizza, oh. camperitos. Oh my God, I love the junk food. <laughs> yeah. You know, most of the time, whatever we like the most is not that good for us. Yeah, I know. That happened to me. I always, I, I don't know, but I have one day on the week that I say, oh, my God, I want hamburger, I want camperitos, I want Starbucks or whatever. I, I know it's not good, but that's my guilty yeah. pressure. <laughs> uh, yeah, besides that, eating healthy is expensive. Yeah. Sure. Healthy food is not cheap. Man, that is crazy. That's why, I mean, I don't complain. I eat whatever comes. Okay, guys, it was a very, very interesting activity and a very nice class. Let me get the attendance one last time, please. Ada Susana Caceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Ambarelli Alfaro. Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Present teacher. Henry Neftalí Méndez Torres. Ileana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Present. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. I'm here. 
José Marcos Rodríguez Ayala. Present. José Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present. Teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present. Teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Rebeca Jasmine Monterrosa Figueroa. Present. Thank you, Rebeca. Rebeca, I didn't hear you tonight. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present, teacher. Belman Frank Figueroa Peñate. Present. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Fernando Marcos González Martínez. Thank you, Ramón. Present. Thank you, Fernando. Hey, guys. Uh, a very interesting class. Uh, please don't forget to work in the platform. And if you've got any doubts right now at the end, I'm gonna stay with a uh, couple of you. Uh, have a good weekend, enjoy it. Please enjoy it, rest as much as possible. I know you have a hard week and some of you had a terrible week. Uh, I expect to see you on Monday. Thank you for being here in my class. Have a good night. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good See you, man. Good weekend. Thank you. Okay, teacher. Yep. Uh, I have problem in the midterm with one question. Okay, give me a second. Me too, teacher. I had some. I I was I am a little bit confused with some okay, exercise. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Me too. Midterm. Midterm, yeah, part four. Part four. Okay. Read the following tips related to return policies when shopping online. Decide whether they are good or bad. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. The 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 last the one second is... part. Okay, yeah, type in reported I, speech. Yeah. She I, told me they had gone out last night. Yeah, I had that, my answer. I, I, I sent you in the chat. I trying with, oh, with period oh. in the end, with last night. Copy yeah, paste I, what I, I just sent you. I trying, ah, or oh, had gone, ah, had gone. Yep. Because I I I trying it. Okay, <laughs> I trying with last night, but not have done. You know, they went. Okay. Okay, teacher. Uh, I'm complete. Okay, perfect. Okay, only uh, only the part. Tengo una parte que tiene errores en la anterior. Creo que esa no la he reportado, ¿verdad? Which one? Uh, give me a second. It's two point... two point something. Yes, I reported and they haven't fixed it yet. Uh, okay, uh -huh. I made the report. I let you know as soon as they fix it. Okay, but if they fix it, I suppose that our answer are correct. So we don't need to do anything. Or yes. And if they don't fix it, I will give you the ones that are in the platform so you can get the points. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay, that's all for me. Good night, everyone. Have a good night, teacher. Okay, guys. Thank you. Who else? Me, teacher. About two point two homework. Yeah, I, I guess it's the one that we are talking about. Let me check it out. Um, confused about the exercise. I don't know what I have to do. What I have to do. 2.2, okay. you said. Okay, let's see, 2.2. Ah, 2.2, the answers. Which part? Second or the first the or the whole, second? Read the following commands and tie them using reported speech. The and whole, the, the whole. Tell me number one, what you got? Here. For example, I have he told that he exercised regularly. 
Okay. He told me to exercise regularly. He told me. To The second exercise. one. He the ordered second. not to turn off the lights. He? He ordered he not, order not to turn off the lights. Not turn off the lights. Okay, let's do something because this is going to be too slow for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay, give me just a second. I'm gonna try to make it easier for you, my friend. Are you checking out what I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. sending you? Yeah, of course. And the second part, the same problem. Second part, yeah. I have, for example, in the first, the first one, I have. He asked, he asked me if I'm leaving. No, if I family. live, if I live. Okay, if I live. Okay. And the uh, the second one. Remember that can needs to be changed into cool. Cool. He asked me if I could talk. If he could talk to me for a minute. If he, okay. And the third one, he asked me if. If I if spoke I, Spanish. If I spoke Spanish, so that's in past. The fourth one, he asked me if that is my cat. That was my cat. That was us. Because, okay. Yeah, I got it. No, I got it right now. And then you go. He asked me if I was listening to him. Yeah, okay. Thank you, teacher. No problem. Have a good night. Confused. Thank you. Thank you. Mr. Rivas. Yes, teacher. Uh, I have, have a question. Yes, the, about, mm -hmm. the platform, sorry, with exercise, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, 2.5, the... Okay, give me a second to get into it. Sure. Okay, that, that one's got a problem. The second part or the first part? Uh, the last part, the second, uh -huh, the last part, so with the W L. Okay. Now, in the first one, there's a mistake in the platform because they forgot place in the period. But it goes like this. Look in the chat. My new neighbor asked me how many children I have. So I, I fix it. So just the ones that I had problem. So eh, that's the one. No, no, the, that is the this one that um, hey, when did you move to the city that's the oh, one my new neighbor asked when i had moved to the city oh yeah that's another one that's got a problem right at the end you need to place two periods two period okay yeah, just in this case there's a mistake and they haven't fixed it up yet two periods oh, and that's okay. it that's it yeah got it now okay. yes Perfect. Appreciate that issue. No problem. No problem. Have a wonderful day. And rest of See. the day. <laughs> yeah, because I still gonna be here. Have a good night. Take care. Thank you. Teacher.